Hey guys, Ricky here with Apple Valley Farm. Today we're doing something really, really special. Uh, most of you may not know, we spend very, very little time making things for ourselves or for our own house, but today we are, and I'm really excited about it. So we're putting in a reclaimed wood wall down at the end of our hallway. It's just a small wall, but we just wanted to see how it was gonna turn out, and I wanted to share that with you guys. I'm really excited about it. I love it. And if you like it, then give us a shout. Let us know. We'd love to put one in in your house or your business or wherever. So I hope you enjoy this. And thanks for watching. All right, so here's our space. And uh, so the first thing we need to do is start getting some stuff out of the way. And then uh, we'll prep the wall and uh, we'll be ready to go start putting it together. So like we said, the first thing we want to do is clean our space out, wipe the wall down, then we want to paint the wall black. The reason we're painting it black is because since these are reclaimed wood boards, they're not going to be perfect and there are going to be some cracks and there are going to be some openings and we want the black to show through in those openings so it looks like a shadow. Now we want to measure some boards off, cut them to length, we'll be ready to start building our wall. You'll want to use an electronic stud finder to find the studs behind the sheetrock. That way you'll know where we want to nail. And now we are ready. Here we go. Putting up the wood one piece at a time. I'm using my cordless Ryobi Airstrike Nailer using some one inch nails and we're just nailing these up on the wall nothing really special to do here we're just putting everything together it's going pretty quickly not as quickly as it looks like here in this time-lapse video but really it does go pretty quickly want to check our levelness on the way down, we want to make sure our boards aren't getting off kilter. And so far, everything's going just fine. We want to work our way down all the way to the bottom. And then finally, the last piece will cut to width. And there you have it. Look at that. It looks great. And it only took a couple hours. Thanks a lot for watching and hope you enjoyed it.